And here what you're going to do is just select the JSON that you downloaded, press open and it'll create the whole automation workflow for you. So hey everyone, hope you're all doing well. So in this video, I'll show you exactly the easiest way to get any type of template from a YouTube video. So NA10 template, the easiest way uh, without joining any type of school community or downloading something or paying something. So yeah, for a beginner, this would be maybe the easiest way to actually learn. So how you're going to do it is you go on any type of YouTube video where you want to get the template and you're going to scroll down below and you'll see um, view transcription. And then what you're going to do is you're going to see the transcript and you're just going to copy paste the whole transcript um, like this. And then from here you go into Claude. And so this doesn't work with any type of other LLM. You need to use Claude. You cannot use ChatGPT or DeepSeek or anything else. It has to be Claude. And then even better if you can use the extended version uh, just because it's better in terms of coding. And so what we'll do here is we'll ask Claude to create a JSON downloadable file um, based on the transcript that I'll give it. And then we'll upload it into the NA10 uh, workflow. So let's just do like this. Hey, Claude, please create a NA10 JSON file based on this transcript. You will need to create exactly the different nodes from the transcript. Yeah, something like this. And then what you're going to do is you're going to just paste the transcript here and then you press on enter. And what this will do is it will create a JSON file uh, with the with with some code and it will give you an idea of how the automation workflow should be. If you want to go even further than this, you could actually just talk with Claude and say, look, I want to create this, um, create the JSON file for me to upload to NA10 and that will give you a good idea of how it should actually be created. So for example, we'll, we'll, we will test this after, but I could say create a JSON file um, based on the description that I'll give you. And then there I could maybe say, yeah, we need to create like a receptionist for a reception. We need to create a receptionist AI agent for this hotel um, uh, that is connected to a knowledge base. So here is just creating the different types of nodes. So basically this whole NA10 flow is, is basically code. Um, and so, so yeah, so just waiting for this to be complete. Okay, great. So this is complete. So what you can do is you'll just download to file and once it's downloaded, then you can directly upload it to NA10. So the way to upload it is you press on the three dots. And here, what you're going to do is just select the JSON that you downloaded, press open, and it'll create the whole automation workflow for you. So of course, it's not exactly the same, but it gives you a good idea of how to uh, build it. And then what you need to do is you just need to edit in the different fields. Uh, so for example, connect your OpenAI account, connect the different APIs, um, but everything is already pretty much filled in. And then, yeah, you'll just have to do some tests and correct it. Uh, but yeah, this is the best way to get any type of template easily from a YouTube video. Um, and then what you could do as well is you could, for example, uh, let's do a test. Hey Claude, this is great. So what I need right now is I need to create an AI agent that will have the purpose of helping uh, current hotel guests. Um, so yeah, I need you to create the AI agent node and the AI agent node needs to be connected to a knowledge base and also needs to use ChatGPT as model to well reply back um, to help the hotel guests. So yeah, you have to make sure that there is a, the right prompt in the AI agent node. Um, and then what I want you to do is anytime, anytime there is a new person that fills in the lead form, I want you to directly sync it to my Airtable CRM. So also make sure to create that node. Um, yeah, I need this as a JSON file that I can easily download and upload to NA10. So yeah, and then once that's done, you can just Send that out and then it'll create a new JSON file that you can download and upload to NA10. Yeah, so this would be another way that you can do it. Um, now, I do 
Now I do think it's best uh, to just go and, and to get the template directly because this will be 100% accurate to what is shown in the video. But this is just another way um, of doing this and that could work out uh, pretty well, especially if you're a beginner. So yeah, so what you do is you just download it to a file and press on the three dots. Once you have uploaded it, then you have something like this. And uh, basically here, what you need to do is fill in the prompt um, and then just fill in the rest. And you go, this is how you would easily create an automation workflow in NA10 using Claude. So Claude would build it out for you. And then from there, you can basically do anything. So this would be the easiest way to download any type of template from a YouTube video. Um, or if you have an idea in mind, but you don't know how to build it, just ask Claude to provide you a JSON file that you can upload to your NA10 workflow, and then it will just do the work for you. But you will need to still change the fields, and also you need to tweak it a bit for, for it to make sense and to work. So yeah, hopefully this was useful, and I see you in the next video.